Hey everybody, it's Sugar Connor. Welcome back for more Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we got to Glitzville. In this episode, we are going to hopefully get to our locker room and start getting in some fights here at the arena that we signed up for. Jolene, could you come in here a minute, darling? Whoa, uh, she's kind of weird looking. Fix her glasses. Yes, sir, you wish to see me? Sure did, hun, Jolene. This is the great Gonzalez, our newest rising star. Be a peach and take him on down to the minor league locker room, alrighty? Right away, sir. Very straightforward. Ha, <laughs> Mr. Gonzalez. I like this. I like the thing about that. So, wait, our first name is The, our middle name is Great, our last name is Gonzalez, apparently. As you know, you're a constructed fighter now, so you must abide by some rules. First and foremost, Mr. Grubba says ghost, period. You must do what he says. Da 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 da. For your contract, you cannot quit until Mr. Grubba releases you. There are many other small guidelines I'll explain as they become relevant. Alright, whatever. That door handle looks like a comma, but whatever. Just shows how text and this game can really be. Alright. This is our locker room. What a rip. You didn't show us this when starting it. We're starting in the minor leagues. To work our way up to the major leagues. He didn't mention this at all before we signed that long signing our life away contract. Alright, so to reserve a match, but you just gotta walk up to the thing and press A. Alright, not a big deal. Let's go ahead and reserve a match. Well, howdy, Gonzalez. Ready to get your fist dirty, huh? There you go, son. All right, whatever. So our first battle is going to be against the Goomba Bros. All right, they're a piece of cake. All right, so in this fight, we have to appeal to the crowd at least one time. Uh, the thing is, Grubble will give us guidelines uh, for things that you have to do in these fights. There's several different things that he'll... Uh... Yes, we got all that. Uh, okay, he, she was basically just explaining that when we get up to rank 11, that'll be our uh, fight to get in, into the uh, major leagues. Um, now when the security guard comes, that's we just gotta follow him. Alright, security escorts us to the ring. Anyway, Grubble will give us guidelines for things we have to do during the fight. Uh, you have to do those things or else it won't count as a win. You'll just remain at the same rank if you don't do the things that he says. Whereas if you lose fights, you go down a rank. Win fights, go up a rank. Simple as that. Square enough next, folks, are the hoppin' hotheads, the Goomba Bros! And newcomer with a hankering for hammering, the Great Gonzalez! The Goomba Brothers have been waiting and getting all head up for the fight. Let's check in! How do, Goomba Bros? How are you feeling today? You ready for this fight? Ha! Are you kidding, man? We're always ready to bonk a fool or two. Who is this Gonzalez? We're a cocky idiot. That's who. Wait and just makes me just mad. We're gonna teach Starty Punk how to respect fighters with seniority. I think maybe you ought to call an ambulance for him now, just to save time later. Oh, well, they're calling us out. How dig dang fight, fans? There's the great Gonzalez now striding on up. I tell you, this rookie's got some good strolling up late, like he owns the place. Who? Okay, now Gonzalez, listen up. Let me just explain the rules of the match real quick. Have a bonk, bonk! Oh god, no, they first struck us. Question is, why is Mario allowed to have a partner in this fight? Yeah, you can't go attack for the bell rings, it's cheating. Yeah, whatever. Quit crying, will ya? That was just a welcome gift. It didn't even do any damage anyway, who cares? Uh, let's just go ahead and appeal with Mario. Simple enough. And then Koops, just power shell him. I recommend using Koops for this fight just because it gets the job done fast, whatever. Job done. Alright, like that could be any easier. The Greek Gonzalez wins. Tell me, son, what was the ta first taste of victory like? Battle was savage. It was okay. A fight? What a joke. A whooping. <laughs> All right, give it up for the Great Gonzalez. Hmm. All right, that was fight number one. Don't worry, the next fights and everything won't be quite as long. Not enough cutscenes. Uh, that fight wasn't a total loss. Okay. And we got our fight money. Three coins! So much for... Ah. Alright, so we just gotta reserve our next fight. Okay, three coins. So much for rich and, you know, stardom and all that crap. Jeez. Uh, Yo, Rook, how was your first fight, dog? Oh, who's this? 
I'm King K, man. I'm just a, just a bush league scrub like you. Good meeting you, man. You look like a stand-up dude, and I think I can I think I can hang with you. All right. Hey, so why don't you meet the gang, huh? This guy here is Master Crash. It's to meet you, bum. Now that we gotten to know each other, I will give you advice, bum. It's Mr. Lee was saying you'd better bum obey Mr. Grubba's conditions. All right. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. And, alright, who's this guy? And this guy is Bandy Andy. Okay. Alright, so that um, bed over there will recover everything but star, uh, star power. Okay, so we can recover our HP and our FP in it, but not star power. Alright, so that's going to make this chapter a little bit challenging. We won't be able to recover our star power at any real time. That bed will not recover star power. Let's just go ahead and, I guess, rest in it really quick. Okay, let's go ahead and reserve our next match. Alright, our next opponent is going to be the KP Koopas. So we ought to avoid using any special moves. Okay. And since we're going up against him in the next round, geez. Yeah, our next match is against him. Wow, against our new friend. Uh, now what I like doing is getting in front of the door and just walking back and forth, and then eventually they hit us with the door, and Mario's like, ah! Alright, let's go. Why, why isn't he... Wait a minute, he's not escorting the KP Koopa, but they got to the match. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's do this. Now, for special moves, he means uh, moves that use star power. So, anything that uses FP that's, you know, from badges or anything, you can do that. So, that isn't a big deal. Look at that, there's punies in the audience. Ah, whatever. Let's go ahead and power bounce this jerk up here. I believe they have the same stats as regular Koopas, though, so they shouldn't be a problem. Alright, that was actually really good. And go! Die. Yeah, these guys aren't strong at all. They really aren't all that bad, honestly. <laughs> see why he's still in the minor leagues after being around for with us for, you know, I mean, after being around for, around for so much longer than us. God, I can't even talk. And wow, he even missed us? Jeez. Okay, even though he's our buddy activity, he sucks out loud at fighting. I say dump him. No, I'm kidding. Alright. The Great Gonzalez wins! He was like, we, we won? Cool! Alright, we got our fight money here. Not like we needed to use any special moves on that. And our ranking rose. Not bad. Let's go ahead and get in another fight. Oh. What do we got here? Way to hand out a beatdown out there, man. You beat me straight up. Jeez. Could swing the other way next time. You know what I'm saying? Oh, great. Just like a stereotype. He's always got to say, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? 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 Yes! I know what you're saying. All right, let's see here. The Pokey Triplets. Alright, so we got the Pokey Triplets coming up in the next fight. Not bad. Uh, I say stick with Koops for now, just because, you know, the Pokies have spikes on their sides and on their tops and everything. And, of course, you know, <laughs> spike tops. But, uh, yeah, if you have Koops uh, out there, then he'll... Uh... If Koops out there, jeez, I can't talk, then, you know, it'll be a lot easier to attack him. Alright, we have the Mus Merciless Executioner. Alright, and the Spike Terror Triplets... The Pokey Triplets. Alright, yes, we can do this. Go ahead, touch us. It won't hurt too much. Yourself's ready to battle! Alright, whatever. Alright. Use special moves. Okay, again, same conditions as last time. I don't use special moves. Not bad. There we go. Did it both action commands that time? You know what? I think these guys should get moving a little bit faster. If you get what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying. Oh, all the punies ran away. Yeah, something I didn't mention before is that I bought a few more badges with all those star pieces that I got. Yeah, we won. Um, I got the chill out badge, the uh, flower finder, which makes it those so that you get more flowers at the end of battles. Uh, the heart finder, so you get more hearts at the end of battles. The item hog, so you get items more often at the end of battles. And then um, the quick change badge, which allows you to change partners without wasting a turn. Of course, those won't be too helpful in this fight. I just got them for later. Hey, what's cracking, G-Man? G-Man? <laughs> you just finished beating down some poor fools or what? You looking good, man. King K wouldn't mind a little bit of your luck, man. 
Luck? What are you talking about, luck? Let's go. Get in there, you! Jolene. That room is absolutely off limits. Okay. Following her around and being creepy. Oh, it looks like somebody has a stalker. Again, dude, man, you're just a magnet for trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't mean to bring Queen Nag in here. Ah, whatever. Don't sweat it, B money! <laughs> She, she can take that attitude and shove it up her nose. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Well, anyway, we got it a lot done for this episode, all right? So, next time on Paper Mario, The Thousand-Year Door, we're going to continue with these fights, okay? See you next time.